Millions of people looked up to the skies today. The moon crossed paths with the sun, partially blocking out light to regions of North America. A Cree constellation expert says First Nations people have been looking at the stars for centuries, and our culture and traditions are deeply rooted in it. We originate from the stars. We call those ones Achagwasa. And we have something inside of us called Achak, which is spirit. So we have that connection. And um, whatever occurs up in the sky is uh, related to us somehow. Wilford Buck has always been interested in the stars. And through decades of ceremony and stargazing, he's gained knowledge of First Nations-based science and astronomy. He says First Nations people were very knowledgeable about eclipses. They were understanding about what, what the eclipse was and when it was happening. In, in the Cree language, uh, eclipse is called caught the whale. Caught the whale, it, uh, loosely translated, is like smothering of light. Buck teaches students about that history and the importance of First Nations people's connection to the skies and says First Nations people were the world's first scientists and had a vast knowledge about the heavens. That sky up there, we have knowledge of that sky just like anybody else. Everybody that lived on the uh, northern hemisphere, our half of the world, went outside at night and saw those same stars, saw the same constellations, saw the same Milky Way, the same moon, the same planets. It wasn't only Romans and Greeks that went outside and looked up at, at night. It was every culture. So it was Romans and Greeks were the lucky ones who got put into the school curriculum. But everybody had their connections to the stars. Buck says it's his journey in life to educate not only First Nations people, but the public about the importance and historical ties that First Nations people have to the stars. He says First Nations astronomy is one part of First Nations culture that he's striving to revitalize, and the eclipse is the perfect opportunity to do that. Larissa Burnoff, APTN National News, Saskatoon.